Hello everyone. In this video, we're going to see the solution for the leaf code problem two sum. So basically, we're given an array of integers, and we have to return the indices of the two numbers such that they add up to a specific target. For example, given this integer array, and the target is nine, you can see that two and seven add up to nine, and two and seven are at are at the indices zero and one. So the answer to be returned is zero and one. So we can do it in Using we can do it using brute force, but it will take O of n square time, which won't be efficient. So we're going to do this in a very efficient way using hash map. So let's first create the integer array in which we're going to show the indices, and then the map. So let's name the map as map itself. Let's go to new hash map integer comma. Oh, it's not needed. Yeah. So what we're going to do is we're going to take all the values from the array given, which is nums. So nums dot length i plus plus and the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to see that whether we have already gotten the other part in the map so what is other part other part is target minus nums of i so for each nums of i for each value in the array nums we're checking whether we've gotten the complement of it in the map already. So we'll check that if map dot contains key other part. So if, if map already has other part, then we have already gotten our answer because each input has exactly one solution. So in that case, what we do is simply say b of zero is equal to map dot get other part the index of other part and b of one is equal to a current in current index i then break so if you find such a value in our map such that the current value in that add up to be the target then we've gotten our answer else we put in the current we add the current element in the map so map dot put nums of i comma i and then return our answer b so basically what we did was we made a map for integers and we're adding the values from our array nums into the map and at any point if we found a value in map so that the current value and that add up to be the target we show those indices in b of zero and b of one so let's try to see if this works okay yeah so as you can see the runtime is one ms partially than 99.89 percent because we did it in a very efficient way and did it using only one loop in O of n time. 